The Piaggio P180 Avanti Evo blends the very best of Italian style and performance with greater range, faster climb, a lower noise footprint, added safety systems, and a more luxurious cabin. Avanti Evo is yet another step forward. The third generation aircraft offers a maximum speed of 402 knots, making it one of the world's fastest multi-utility turboprops. Here is everything you need to know about the Piaggio P180 Avanti Evo. Stay with us till the end of the video to learn more about this luxurious turboprop. Access to the cabin is straightforward. The upper two-thirds of the door on the port side, just behind the flight deck, opens toward the nose of the aircraft, and a gust lock keeps it flush to the side of the fuselage. The lower section, containing two integral carpeted steps, is released by a handle on the left and lowered into position. On first glimpse, the cabin interior is impressive, with a two-place bench seat opposite the door, a single sideways facing seat on the same side as the door, and four club-arranged seats leading to a full privacy toilet. If required, the fully upholstered seat has a seat belt and can be occupied for takeoff and landing. The aircraft can accommodate a maximum of eight passengers and two crew with enough room to work and relax, and features a galley and an enclosed lavatory with a belted potty in typical configurations. Cabin dimensions are great and more in line with a mid-sized jet. The spacious stand-up cabin is 5 foot 9 inches or 1.75 meters high, 6 feet 1 inch or 1.85 meters wide, and 15 feet or 4.55 meters long. And once strapped into one of the roomy leather seats, space abounds. The luxurious cabin is also redesigned with two separate rows of rotatable leather seats, a stylish use of mirrors, six good-sized windows on either side, and use of light colors, which ensure the cabin has a roomy feel. It is equipped with broadband and satellite connectivity, transforming it into a flying office. Enhanced air conditioning system and lighting also contribute greatly to passenger comfort. The Avanti Evo has an external baggage area which has acceptable dimensions but is not pressurized. Avantis are certified to fly as high as FL410 and maintain a low cabin altitude of 6,600 feet or 2,000 meters at that level. During the flight, the cabin is conversationally quiet since the propellers are way behind the cabin. On the ground, however, the Avanti Evo's noise footprint is on the high scale which is typical of pusher designs. The cockpit is comfortable. The seats can be raised or lowered with a lever outboard to provide a view that should just about look down onto the top of the glare shield. Because of the rake angle of the windshield, the glare shield is very deep and provides a perspective unique to the Avanti. No nose is visible ahead, but down into the right from the seat, you can see the tip of the forward wing and the shapely winglet. The cockpit is equipped with a Rockwell Collins ProLine 21 avionic suite with a tablet-based electronic flight bag. It also includes twin control panels, three large adaptive flight displays, a convenient cursor control panel, an integrated avionics processor system, four data concentrator units, a state-of-the-art weather radar, traffic collision avoidance system, as well as a terrain awareness and warning system. The airframe of the Avanti Evo has been improved by introducing the three lifting surface design that is characterized by small front wings, inverted central wings, and the tail's flat surface elevation. The design provides the aircraft stability and control at high speeds. The elegant aerodynamic curve from nose to tip improves laminar flow and reduces drag, maximizing the performance by 34%. The drag-reducing winglets and redesigned forward wing improve efficiency and reduce CO2 emissions by 3% and enable the aircraft to climb 3% faster. The Avanti Evo is powered by two Pratt & Whitney Canada PT6A 66B engines with a TBO of 4,100 hours and 850 shaft horsepower each. 
and two 85-inch diameter five-blade scimitar propellers developed by Hartzell. This combination is able to push the Avanti Evo to a maximum cruise speed of 402 knots and up to a maximum cruising altitude of 41,000 feet or 12 and a half kilometers with an average hourly fuel burn of 80 gallons or 303 liters per hour. The Avanti Evo series received European Aviation Safety Agency certification for the auxiliary fuel tank in June 2014. The addition of an auxiliary tank increases the aircraft's fuel capacity from 2,826 pounds to 3,226 pounds and the maximum range by 17% and enables the aircraft to make transcontinental journeys and U.S. coast-to-coast -coast flights with just a single fueling stop. The Avanti Evo has a maximum range of 1,490 nautical miles, which is 1,715 miles or 2,760 kilometers when in the standard configuration and 1,770 nautical miles for the increased range configuration, which is 2,040 miles or 3,280 kilometers. The Avanti Evo can take off in 3,190 feet or 970 meters, has a maximum rate of climb of 2,770 feet per minute, and a landing distance of 3,280 feet or 1,000 meters, all while maintaining a maximum net payload of 1,750 pounds or 794 kilograms. The new wide cord lightweight propellers are made from aluminum alloy and are fully feathered, reversible, and hydraulically controlled with constant speed. The propeller RPM was reduced from 2,000 to 1,800. These features, along with aerodynamic changes, redesign nacelle and engine exhaust geometry, reduce external noise by 68% and internal cabin noise by 20%, elevating passenger comfort further. Avanti Evo features a new low-maintenance landing gear, including steerable dual-wheel nose gear and two single-wheel main landing gear units. Each main wheel is fitted with carbon anti-skid brakes. The aircraft can operate from peripheral airports and smaller airfields with short runways of less than 1,000 meters in length that do not serve scheduled flights. The base price for a Piaggio Avanti Evo is $7.7 .7 million. While the total fixed cost is roughly $300,000 per year, the average hourly operating cost is estimated at $2,000. Thank you for staying with us till the end. Here are two videos you can watch next. If you enjoyed this video, please make sure to leave a like and subscribe. Thanks for watching.